What's up? What's good? What's popping? By now, Najosha, mkama say that interview was amazing. Kalamoto is fire. Yani ni katu la moto. Anyway, guys, that's enough. I mean, that's just about it. And then we have another interview coming right up after this one with Michelle coming through. Don't forget, my name is Karen Jessa Fiongo. Hi, Dad. How are you doing? Yes, and it's your favorite TV girl. <laughs> you know what I mean? You can find me on Facebook as Karen Kang and on Twitter, Karen Kang. There you have it. It's now Karen Kang. Now, today in studio, Maze, I have a very special guest. He is an entrepreneur. At the same time, he's an artist. He'll tell us about his other entertainment business, which is <laughs> at Atuambia. Lakini, first off, let me introduce my guest. He is Cash. How are you doing? Yala, yala. Mane, I'm good, mane. I'm good. <laughs> first of all, let me, let me, let me know. You, Jini, me talk about Cash, cause. Cash ni jina tu, ni mzuka. Mzuka. Yeah, it's a vibe. It's a vibe. It's a vibe. Labla nikuwa nafana natuna ganji kabidi. Oh yeah, hata tutu uja maa cash. Hey! Nuna jua mina penda dobi zi. Basu nani penda na ujue. Ah. Wacha kaka, wacha. Wacha kuzengua. Wanzengua. Anyway, so kindly let us know. Where do you come from? You know, nuna toka pande gani. Home, home kwanza mali natoka. My uko mm -hmm. ni kisi. Kisi. Eh, shout out kila msia na watch kutoka kisi manzi. Uh -huh. eh, lakini uku mjini kawanguwa re 46 kama kawa. Wewe. Eh, Tukonda ni anyumba vba sana. Kumbe we ni neba yangu hapo tu. Manzi. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, so uh -huh. tuingilia katika mziki. Mziki umeanza lini mazi. Kuzi ngoma ngoma uh -huh. ukonazo na ngoma ni tamu. Uh -huh. Ngoma ziko mazi. Eh, mziki ni manza kitambo mazi. Uh -huh. Um, oja wasi usema nga ni watu mezo ya kusema mziki nilianza kitambo siju kutoka wapi nini lakini ya ukiona mtu ni msani mm -hmm. jua ni kitu iko inborn uh -huh. ni kitu probably yani ni kama umeblesi wanayo kutoka kabla ato kuje kwa iwa mm -hmm. mm -hmm. ndo weze kwa MC weze kwa artist ni kitu yani imekuanga na wewe kutoka kitambo mm -hmm. so neza sema minu mekua artist for as long as I can remember Eh hey. hey, nikiwa mtoi nilikuwa na enjoy mangoma sana unajua kuandika andika mm -hmm. hey, kuchocha mm -hmm. so there's some new qualities for as long as i can recall eh hey, okay uh, since you can remember your you know past days uh, how was it like recording your first song if you compare mm, yourself then and now <laughs> hey, my first song was ilikuwa i think ni late to 7 to 8 huko uh -huh. and kitambo your feeling ilikuwa epic Unajua ile like you've always wanted to do something alafu finally mm -hmm. unajipata kwa studio finally umeandika mistari yako ya kwanza mm -hmm. unajua it wasn't all perfect unajua ngoma ya kwanza ya kila mtu inakuanga tu ni zile mzuko umekuwa kiimagine tu mm -hmm. so i can say it was epic mm -hmm. ilikuwa poa yeah, my first song man eh hey, hata ilikuwa ni tu acha tasikumbuki <laughs> <laughs> so to uh, to say cash kama rapper a kenyan rapper ni nini humu inspire ni nini you muamsha asubuhi mm -hmm. anaenda studio anasema yo what's up today i'm I'm, I'm here, I'm about to drop this track, I'm a, you know, in, in two days time, I'm a, in one week's time, I'm about to drop a tune. As uh, in, what drives you? As me, me I inspire you on a life, in the mm -hmm. Most of my songs, most of my poetry, most of my inspiration, mm -hmm. ni life, ya, ni, ni vitu ni mepitia, ama vitu mabisizango mepitia, ama vitu probably umeona maali na ukamuacha ni painty picture. Mm -hmm. At least, yeze kusaidia mtu in one or another. Ama ku highlight, yani hizi vitu zi utendeka. Mm -hmm. So uneza sema sana sana minu inspired na life. Na life. Uh, na real life situations. Yani. Real life situations. Uh, Aside from music, you also yeah. have a business going on. Aside from yeah. you rapping, you also have, you know, some side hustle. Ni kama uh. weni msiwa hustle mbaya, mbaya, mbaya. So hey, tell us about, tukua. you know, Grindhouse. Uh, Grindhouse, is Grindhouse? Grindhouse is actually an entertainment entity. Hata sezi sema company. Na sema ni entity kwa sababu. Uh, na hizo sema more or less me I do music 100. Unajua? Si unajua kuna watu ingina wane sema mini msani lakini nafanya hii. Ama mimi nafanya hii alafu mini msani. Mm -hmm. Mine hizo sema na do music na entertainment. As it's like a career, like a lifestyle. Mm -hmm. Sasa ndio tukanzisha hii kampuni na some of my friends. My childhood friends unajua. Mm -hmm. So tukasema at least kama mimi nimepata position fulani hata niweze kuwa able to inspire other people wenye pia wanataka hii vibe na labda ni tricky kwao in one way or the other unajua mm -hmm. So tulianzisha kampuni inaitwa Grindhouse Entertainment 
So tunaendelea at least tuna, we are playing our part. Tunadu kile tunaweza fanya for the industry at large. Mm -hmm. Tuone mali tunaweza fika. Mm -hmm. uh, but mimi nasema nafanya muziki by the way. Na wale wanafikiria muziki si kazi, muziki ni kazi. Muziki ni kazi. Uh, na lot. Eh uh, mara mingi eh uh, mara mingi napenda kuuliza so mm -hmm. wewe ni msanii alafu unafanya nini nyingine? <laughs> Sasa mimi niko za mbona unataka nifanye kitu nyingine? Can't I just be an artist? Tunajua. Naweza kuwa msanii, mm. usanii na lipa, usanii mm. ni livelihood, mm -hmm. inalea familia. True. Unajua. It's a choice. It's a choice. Eh, unaweza kuwa msanii na kuwa msanii. But then, Full stop. No, let's be honest. There's some people who are actually mm. saying usanii hailipi. Ama ukiwa msanii lazima you know mm. Lazima kuwe na another side hustle. That's why so many people are especially our parents wako mm. na ideology. But then again, kuna huyo kijana nafikiria usanii mm. hailipi. Mzee utamwambia nini? Mzee inalipa but inategemea. Mm -hmm. Siwezi sema ati sasa Jukash amesema msanii inalipa. Unajua u drop kila play. kitu ukata kwenda shule, mm -hmm. uache kila kitu ufanye hapana. Mm -hmm. Fanya kile iko do what you can do when you can do it. Mm -hmm. But I can say for a fact music is actually a career. Watu wanafanza ku take serious kutoka kwa gava kutoka wapi unajua hata wazazi mm -hmm. like chukulia msanii kama mtu anaenda mtu amevaa suti enda kazi asubuhi is the same mm -hmm. yeah, it's a job take it seriously mm -hmm. itaku itaku sustain mm -hmm. yeah. all right sasa nataka tuingie katika you know your mm -hmm. line of work which is rapping you mm -hmm. dropped a track kitambo kidogo nataka tuongelele ghetto but mm -hmm. first tuongelele kovu <laughs> <laughs> you know, I love ska, you know what uh, I mean? <laughs> so, nini li ku drive, ama ili kufanyo u nini, u fanyo, u drop yo, nini, um, instru, u chukwe yo instrumento lia kovu, mm. we mwenye oji tengeneze yo ka own song, of which it's dope, I actually love the song. Uh, okay, hii kuwa ati, it's something I took as a, ati ni kitu kubo, unajua. Mm -hmm. Ili kwa instru, atu waliko na jibamba nayo. So siku moja rami nilikuwa studio na mchizi wangu producer naitwa Vides. Mm -hmm. So tulikuwa tume chill tu akaniambia oh anaona watu wana watu wana rap rap na hii kovu sana unajua. Mm -hmm. So si uchangamke kwanza nilikuwa skeptical kwa zile za. Mm -hmm. I think it's a good challenge watu wanaichangamkia unajua mm -hmm. na ina, inasaidia ku build culture na ina revolve around unajua mm -hmm. ile idea ya ni kitu imekuja iko kwa culture na at least inasaidia unajua madogo wa jibambe unajua mm -hmm. watu wa flex nini nini so ara mimi nilikuwa studio na huyu mchezaji wangu anaitwa Vides so akaniambia oh si uchangamke hii kitu ngamwambia fresh leta hiyo beat usikie radaki mm -hmm. so tukaeka beat ika nice nice hapo nikachangamka then tulia hapo nikuwa studio pia na best yangu mwingine ni video director mm -hmm. anaitwa Brian M Brand so vile nimemaliza ku record hivi akaniambia bro si uko around eh kesho asubuhi tuchukue kama nje tufanye Uh -huh. to visualize unajua mm -hmm. haiko ati haiko kitu ati imepangwa ati ni kitu nataka kufanya but ili happen and for the culture for the culture yeah, i'm glad it was yeah, it happened to say me too kovu is it's a big tune it's a big tune yeah, yeah it's a big oh don't get me wrong sijasema ati ngoma <laughs> iko chini unajua big up ska kwanza mchizi <laughs> wangu fresh unajua mm -hmm. uh, big up cardinali hata in general unajua madogo machizi fresh unajua mm -hmm. but it was for the culture for the love unajua alafu pia Ukiona kuna watu wanajaribu kufanya kitu unajua lazima uweke support yako hapo unajua mm -hmm. it won't hurt it doesn't unajua i pain mm -hmm. so nilichangamka but kovu is a dope track shout out kila msemo nyali alijump kwa challenge unajua Yay. ni mzuka for the culture for the culture eh, it's a win win great all right <laughs> so nataka tuingilie sasa ghetto mm. ghetto first of all i'm inspired cuz unachangamsha ma youth Mm. waende out there chicken yaje do itakupata ukiume chini manze. manze lazima uamke yeah. utembeze doezi kuna ukia kwa, kwa mlango ati oya hodi ni nani <laughs> ati ni do nimekuja na zingia kwa wale yako ni aje eh yeah. hey. so nataka unieleze uki come up na hiyo ngoma nini nilikuwa kwa mind yako at the time um, actually get on to story true story yeah, i took i told my story mm -hmm. from the exact setting it really happen in kawangware hata video tuli shoot kawangware ambo stage 2 uko nyuma eh tulienda hapo tukashoot video yote hapo like nilikuwa najaribu ojo as much as watu sema wametoka ghetto but what are you doing for the people over there unajua mm -hmm. so mimi story yangu niliamua at one point and i tell mm -hmm. unajua so na ilikuwa fortunate enough niliidu kwa ghetto nili big up hood yangu nikatel story ja unajua kwa ghetto kuna watu wanalala bila food 
True. Eh uko ghetto kuna watu wana viatu. Mm -hmm. Unajua kuna watu wana manyumba. Kuna watu hata wana mali ya kudozi. Ni kweli. Eh na si kwa sababu probably ulizaliwa kwa street. But one way or the other unaweza jipata kwa street. Mm -hmm. Unajua vitu happen. Unaweza kwa job there's leo job imeisha. There's a meme nimeona this week mm -hmm. na mm -hmm. ilikuwa inasema Ni msali andika tu post, akasema, actually it's not a meme, it's actually somebody who posted, akasema TV le, mm. hat, hata why judge mse, cause amefunzwa, uh, God amemweka in such a situation, mm. yenye ule msali kwa na judge, mm -hmm. akajipate in that same situation. Yeah, ukweli, okay, ukweli. Okay, okay. So you could be here thinking, eh, maze we mse, maze ni mbana, eh, ajachana nyuele, kiatu sijuini nini, sijuini nini, nini, and then just one day, God akweke kwa your situation. Bana. Who then, feels it knows it? Bana. Auta wajua situation flani mbaka mm -hmm. ujipata kwa situation. Mm -hmm. Na pia uneza kosa kujipata kwa situation but through ku interact na watu. Ama, for example, miye sema na co-inspired na life. Mm -hmm. Naeza kupenti ya picture flani in a musical form. Mm -hmm. We understand. Oya sure. kuna watu go through hii. Mm -hmm. Kuna watu na laki. Mm -hmm. Kuna mtu wakona hii. Mm -hmm. Kuna uleana. Unajua. Mm -hmm. So, it's a, it's a journey. It's a na lazima uweze kujieka. In someone else's shoes, kama for example, ukiona Bill Gates, lazima at one point ujeke kwa shoes zake, useme, eh, na nika bless you, na hizi vitu zote nezafanya nini. Mm -hmm. Unawana? Mm -hmm. Na lazima pia ujeke kwa shoes ya mse, mwenyana keja, ana food, ana nini, useme, eh, na nika kosa kila kitu. Like, unajua life ni hivi. True. One day uneza lose everything you have right now, True. utadu nini. Mm -hmm. Unawana? Salo maze na kamingi na potea, let me tell yeah, you, I know. Well. <laughs> quick, question, no, quick question, quick question, nambio to wrap up, but I have yeah. a question. Okay, okay. Song yako ghetto iku associated na hustle, iku associated na a story that you're willing to tell. Yeah. Are those uh, teardrops on your eyes? Ni birthmark. <laughs> birthmark. It's not a tattoo? <laughs> Actually, ni tattoo is a teardrop. Whew, fukes, okay. <laughs> so ni tattoo teardrops, ama? Ah, ni teardrops. Tattoo teardrops. Okay, awesome. Iku na relation na you know, story yako, that is ghetto. Eh, yeah, a lot. Mm -hmm. Your teardrops actually, story yako ina kuanga either you've taken life or lost life, mm -hmm. or lost someone close to you. Ah. Uh, so zangu ni machizi wangu, ni mekuja na hao, kuna ingine, uh -huh. atuko na wapa leo, mm -hmm. because of one or two things, unajua. Mm -hmm. So okay. this is my way of remembering them. Mm -hmm. uh. R.I.P. man. So, wape machizi, masalams, mbio mbio, uwapatie social media platform, alafu kisha tuingie katika gero, Guys, yeah, he has so. a very amazing, he has an amazing <laughs> story to tell. So, yeah. first of all, maze, kwanza tuchangamisha na social media platforms zake. Mine memfollow, sujika uta mfollow. <laughs> Piana Yo. social media na machizi wa salimi. Uh, Kamakawa is a boy cash in the building. Mm -hmm. A.K.A. Mr. Grinders Kamakawa. Mm -hmm. A.K.A. the 6 photo ka 46 Kamakawa. Mm -hmm. A.K.A. Omo isi omo thin in the building Kamakawa. Oh, hey. A.K.A. Jai. Alafu Oya, hey. ingia social media zote. Na go by cash grinders. Uh -huh. Grinders ni G-R-I-N-D-H-A-U-Z. Yes, sir. Grinders. Grindhouse. Twitter, Instagram, Facebook, Everywhere YouTube, yeah. uh, cash grinders. What's up was good. So you uh, dropped a track earlier in June. Mm. Gero. Gero. Maze, able to introduce you again. Uh, Angalia ni mta yangu mali ni metoka. Maze, hapa ni home, home. Uh -huh. Ukiwane yo video setting hapo ni mta. Yes, Kila mtu kwa yo video ni megrona ya hapo ni machizi. Machizi tu. Uh. Sawa, basi, wacha tusikize ngoma sasa. Yes. Rajiz, what's up? What's good? 